this is an unusual event to have a tuber tuberculosis within a neonatal intensive care unit, unusual. The fact that we're talking about a smaller contained space with babies adds to the concern. An unidentified person visited the NICU multiple times last November and December, but wasn't diagnosed with tuberculosis until January 3rd. The NICU is located at SUMA Akron City Hospital, but is operated by Akron Children's. Within the unit, we want to examine our patients there. So babies who may have been within the unit could have been exposed and we want to make sure they're not at risk. TB can be very serious, even deadly. It usually involves the lungs and is spread through the air. Most cases can be cured, but health officials are not taking any chances. When you're close to a person who has TB and sneezes, you may inhale their organism. The estimate is 50 babies were potentially exposed to TB. Medical records have identified the infants who were in the NICU during the infected person's visits. Doctors now working to notify all the families and get the babies on antibiotics. Because these are high-risk um, infants, and even though the risk is low but not zero, we are being very prudent. Despite the concerns, health officials say the TB risk is low to the general public. So anyone who was in that neonatal intensive care unit, Akron Children's Unit at SUMA, does not pose a risk to anyone else out in the community.